headed to Waka's shop right now. I haven't been over there. It's been maybe three weeks now since I was able to help work on the trailer. We've just been gone on trips or had other conflicts. I've seen pictures of the current state of the trailer and it's, it's quite a bit different. And I'm actually really excited to see it in person now. all along the roof. There's a bunch that go across and then we have this, this kind of runner going right down the middle. And Walk is adding one last piece of wiring and then we should be able to start putting in the paneling on the roof. Are we gonna we're gonna put insulation first and then Yeah insulation first and then we got starting to come together. <laughs> So it's been a, it's been a few weeks since the last video update on the Wa camper. I've been away on a couple trips. No, one trip. One trip that was like a week and a half long. And uh, there's been a ton of progress while I was away. And so I'll give you a quick update. A lot of it hasn't been like interesting enough to video because it's a lot of like just really tedious cuts of, you know, paneling and <clears throat> plywood and stuff. But here's the trailer. Let's see if I can get it all in frame here. Whoa. So update, let's see, what, what's, I guess the last time, the last video update, I don't even know if we had the side, the walls on yet. I think we just had the frame, I forget. Mm -hmm. But so we have Raptor bed liner is sprayed on, sprayed on here, whoops, on there. Diamond plates installed. The exterior walls are obviously there, sprayed with Raptor. Then there's an inch of insulation and then paneling on the inside. So all the interior paneling is now installed and trimmed. That outlet is wired up, at least from the inside. There's no nothing to connect it to on the other side yet. The beginnings of the interior cabinets and the power system, which I don't know if that's wired up yet, or is that? It's not wired. Okay, not wired yet. And uh, I gotta remember those screws. They're still gonna be covered with trim. They're, oh yeah, that's right. Trim yeah, it's not done. Yeah, so there are some spots where the trim is not done yet, and right here, and right there. Battery box is installed on the front. Five hundred watt, no, thousand watt inverter. This is a storage box. I believe the plan is to have a fridge slider in there, and then the side boxes are on. This one is gonna be. A stove that folds out and this side is where the water heater is gonna go there's gonna be a water heater right about here and then you know more storage and hose for the water heater and stuff propane tank down there still have to cut drill holes on the side here so we can run the hose because this propane tank is gonna be ran to the water heater and also through through here down under here and it'll pop out in here to feed the stove and then today we just finished putting this wall up uh, putting the countertop in and cutting out the cutout for the sink and then there will be cabinets back here I think three cabinets total 
And then right now, we're going to quickly put in the frame, the interior frame for the window and the exterior window and seal it up. And we're going to try to get the door on the other side as well. It's coming along. Still probably a couple of weeks worth of work. And the plan is to try to get this jammed out before we leave for Mexico, which is like three weeks from today. Exactly three weeks from today. Yep. Yeah. This is Mike, by the way. I just realized I don't think I've ever introduced him, but he's in—he's been in a few videos. This is Mike, aka Desert Jeep Rat. He has a blog, Desert Jeep Rat. 